Hello friends, Clayton Phillips here from Woody's RV World in Leduc, Alberta, Canada. We're just 15 minutes south of Edmonton and we're going to do a little bit different video than our standard Grand Design product uh, quick tour and extended tour videos. I uh, wanted to talk a little bit about lamination and uh, that not all laminated RV walls are built the same. Uh, and we're going to point out a few items where Grand Design really shines. You'll find that Grand Design, while they're a heavier trailer, is they're just putting more meat into the, the lamination and the things that they do uh, with, their, with, their, with their products. Uh, we talk about, you know, uh, stuffing aluminum tubes with wood dowels. We talked about framed in window openings. All of those things that really set Grand Design apart from the others. And, um, and this is a wall, we're doing a rear wall. This is a laminated wall off of a 2014 trailer. I'm not gonna share the brand. Um, I just wanna show that not all laminated walls are manufactured the same. And why Grand Design maybe is a little heavier than some of the competition because they're putting the, the structure and the build in where some manufacturers are, are taking out. Uh, and we're just going to start, start on this. So one of the things we talk about Grand Design since their inception, one of their DNA items is that every single window opening is framed in uh, with aluminum on the fiberglass products or wood with the uh, aluminum sided products. Uh, and this particular product, this is one of those brands that does not frame in around the window opening. And this is a perfect example where we have the window out because uh, we're replacing the wall, but you can see that this is all block foam insulation. You got a, a sheet of fiberglass here. You got your inner Luon wall panel and you can see literally that I'm squeezing. Okay. So the windows that RV manufacturers use are called a clamp ring window. And that window, um, there's the inner frame of the window, then there's the outer frame of the window. And there's a whole bunch of screws around the, the, the window frame on the inside of the trailer. And when that window goes in, the inner frame screws into the outer frame and it clamps down. Okay, so you can imagine you want that window to be secure, you want it to be tight. And this is where, you know, moisture intrusion can happen over time where you get that wall flexing. Uh, it, when you have a window that uh, opening that isn't framed in, it allows for that window to free flow or to move around and flex inside that window frame. And just to give you an idea, I was challenged by one of the, the, the viewers on our YouTube page that, you know, it's crazy that why wouldn't they frame in around the window openings? You're talking crazy, but this is, I'm just backing this up with fact that a lot of manufacturers do not laminate or uh, frame in around their window openings. Just to give you an idea, this is an aluminum tube here and I'm squeezing like this does not flex right and you can with Grand Design products you've got an aluminum tube around all of the window openings okay very very important when I flip around this wall I'm going to bring it down and show you that what can happen to the inner wallpaper as well when you have too much movement uh, with your window opening uh, the other thing we talk about with Grand Design uh, in the videos is that they stuff the aluminum tubing with a wood dowel and I'm just going to pull this wall down and I'll show you so inside this wall it's fully laminated it's one piece I don't know if you can see down there uh, but if I zoom in there, get a little bit closer, you can see that that tube is not stuffed with a wood dowel. So with a wood dowel, when the screws go in, you can see the staples from that inner wall board. What happens is, is the trailer flexes and stresses going down the highway. That steel screw can wear the holes open a little bigger, and that's where your trailer can you know, start to squeak and rattle, potential for moisture intrusion and all of those things. So Grand Design, every tube that has a fastener going into it um, is stuffed with a wood dowel this particular product is not uh, and they do that one just to save weight but again long-term product that goes out of warranty the manufacturer is you know washing their hands of it grand design when they manufacture their products they want it to stand the test of time they want customers for life not just on one rv okay uh, the other thing here is you can see uh, because it's not a wind uh, framed in window opening because that window moves in the uh, window well a whole lot more uh, you get wrinkling in wallpaper okay so things that just cosmetic more than anything uh, but it's it's that windows moving and it's and it's wrinkling your wallpaper but again when you get too much movement in a window expansion and contraction that's when moisture intrusion can can creep in and that's where you can get delamination and those types of things again grand design 
wood dowels in all of the aluminum tubing where you've got corner joints and moldings and they're attaching wall panel to wall panel, those types of things and framed out window openings. So just a perfect representation of what separates Grand Design from a lot of the other manufacturers out there. They're not cutting corners, they're about foundation, they're about structure and you get that, that industry leading three year structural warranty because they built the product to support that warranty. So. Again, my name's Clayton Phillips. I'm with Woody's RV World in Leduc, Alberta, Canada, doing a product uh, pitch here on a laminated wall that is not a Grand Design wall and why Grand Design is the real difference. Thanks for your time. Take care.